Yeah, you wouldn't know. We topped off at 57 degrees, but we've been prepping you for this for the past several days. We're in for a one-two punch. First of all, we're going to have some rain snow mixes in town in the morning, windy and colder in the afternoon, and then snow and cold over a broader area of New Mexico on Sunday. So as we get into the afternoon tomorrow, a lot of those rain snow mixes will be over, and most of the snow accumulating on the northern mountains. But look at the big temperature drop with those 15, 25 mile per hour winds across the area. It'll be windy. It'll be cold. That's the setup for your Friday night as well. Now we go into Saturday and we're kind of between weather systems. It will be a uh, windy and uh, well, at least breezy. I think 10 to 20 mile per hour breezes will be pretty common, but notice the shower is starting to develop again across northern and western parts of the state. That's going to set up for, uh, well, the first day of Hanukkah. That's where we are under a winter weather advisory. I was expecting over much of northern New Mexico. In fact, there could be some winter storm warnings going up. We could get this light accumulation of snow throughout the uh, Albuquerque area for the first part of the day, so be prepared for that. That, a better chance for a light accumulation. This would be for Santa Fe, but there's going to be some snowy travel from Raton on into Las Vegas from the Edis Canyon eastward areas between Gallup and Grants areas around 550 as well. So colder air will be coming in. So it looks like that snow area will spread over a broader area of the state. Then we're dry for Monday and Tuesday, but it will be cold temperatures in the low 40s. So all of these will be impact days, meaning it could interrupt your outdoor activities.